which can be used inside of R to find the positions of the trues. That means we need to input something that does a logical check, and then it will tell us the positions of where the trues were at. So let's go ahead and create a vector right here, and then let's take a look at the logical check we are doing right here inside of the which. This is x equals equals 2, which will check each element of x to see if it is equal to 2. The trues right here tell us where the twos were at, but we can put it inside of the which, and then we can see that the twos were in position 3 and position 12. Next, we're going to see if x is less than 0. So here are the trues and falses of where things met that condition. Now, when we put it inside of the which, it'll tell us the positions of everything that was true. We can do more advanced things right here by taking the trues and falses. We can actually return those elements we just saw. So here are the elements that met the conditions by using their positions from the which. We can also use an additional argument if we have a matrix or a data frame. You'll notice empty cars is a data frame. So maybe I want to find where the 21s are at. You can see where they're at right here. But let's use a which right here with a rand equals true. And now we have the positions of the elements that meet this condition.